to take nation baby we back with another video i'm gonna let y'all i'm gonna let you talk this one i'm gonna let you take this one because it's time to get out but we're gonna say thank you you know gotta send a heartfelt message back to cleveland you know it's he gave him a ring what he was a part of the team that gave him. Okay, okay. I'm okay, not gonna okay, say he okay, did it. Okay, okay, okay. That was LeBron about to, too. I'm about to say. <laughs> nah, it was. I mean, Ky yeah. Okay, it was both of them. But about to watch Kyrie Irving's heartfelt goodbye to Cleveland. I'm guessing this is an actual video of him talking because it's four minutes forty seven seconds. I don't know. We just gonna have to see. We just gonna have to see, bro. Anyways, bring the videos in the description. Below. Let's get. It. They got chill with that girl in the state. Hey, that's wild. That gets that gets the uh the viewers. That's uh oh. Yeah, that was hold on, hold on. First, first of all, I, I'm telling. Oh, let bro. me talk about this. I really don't like the move to cut the beard, bro. What is this? <laughs> like I don't even know who this player is, bro. It don't even look like. <laughs> like I mean, I can understand maybe it's a like a new new situation, new look. But please grow that shit back. But we are gonna go ahead. Hold on. Um, that nigga look young as hell. Why his nostrils, like mouse, bro? <laughs> his nostrils is flare right. This now. is crazy, bro. This is crazy. This is, this is your player now. This is your man. Go ahead. Man, uh, it's hard to make videos like this because Why do you, you think want to he's the telling, magnitude he's telling. of oh, um, decisions that you make in your life can affect a lot of people um, all at once. And when you get to that point, um, and you understand that the best intentions for you, um, and ultimately to be in your truth, and find out what you really want to do in your life and how you want to accomplish it, um, that moment comes and you take full advantage of it. And there are no. Um, I don't know. Hold on. I just would like to say he he talking like he made a free agent decision, like he ain't just get traded or for and ask for a trade. But we are gonna keep on going. I feel other like ulterior reasons other than being happy and wanting to be somewhere where um, you feel like it's an environment that's conducive for you maximizing your potential okay. uh, as a human being and word. as a player. That's a good word. I put a lot of hours in um, and and a lot of work into just trying to accomplish things that I have dreamt of as a kid. And it's right there. That's what I'm talking about. He he got the mentality to be the best. He want to be the best. And he Not feel like he can't best. do it under LeBron. He wants to be on his own team. You just gotta I mean, regardless, he's not gonna be the best. Though. Started respect with, I respect it. Um, not only going to Duke, he's but getting drafted him. number one by Dan, Dan, excuse me, Dan Gilbert and his uh, ownership group, Nate Forbes, and also the ball guy, uh, as he likes to be called, um, and their families, and uh, Nick Gilbert actually put in the, uh, the draft call, which is awesome, because I ended up meeting him at the draft lottery, um, and they took a chance on a 19-year-old kid that was coming off a, a stubbed right toe um, of being in a... Stuff. In a very, very uh, immature funny, place though, at the time, that. because I mean, what 19-year-old doesn't um, take their time and make decisions? But uh, man, I grew up. Excuse me, I spent part of my life and my years in the NBA in such a great environment in Cleveland, and being there from the start in 2011, and um, it now coming to an end in 2017, which is still crazy in my mind. Um, but um, I just want to say that all the individuals that I met over my six year span, and I don't say it as if this is a ending friendship or anything like that, but um, you guys understand how much those moments meant to me and connecting with everyone because it matters and I care and I love the world and I love people and I love being around people so um, as guarded as I am and as everyone likes to say that I have a wall up um, spending two minutes or five minutes asking someone um, genuinely about themselves is what I truly care about and to be able to share those moments with um, just everyone in Cleveland and everyone in Ohio and doing something that was 
just an unbelievable experience for all of us. I, I still can't believe, uh, you know, just the feats that we reached in yeah. a six-year span. And, yeah, and I'm truly it. grateful and I'm Could thankful. Get one. Um, this is a special video just strictly to Cleveland and of all of those who are just finding that self-love. Um, and, and that's what I'm here to bridge the gap for. So uh, this is a special thank you to Cleveland. Um, I love all you guys' support and all you guys' love over the course of fan, by the, way, the amount of years I was in but Cleveland. I hear what you say. Um, and, and I say that because I know that the journey continues from this point on. And um, there will be nothing but love that I have for the organization and what we got to be a part of because there are some special individuals there and I'm shouting out you guys and you guys know who you are. And to my teammates, crazy stories, crazy experiences. You better and, shout out LeBron. By unbelievable himself. human beings, man. I mean, I know how this brotherhood goes, man. All love. You. It's all love. I don't even want to talk about him no more. I just want to see what he's going to do. I'm, I'm just going to. I ain't even. All right. Hey, <clears throat> mark my words. Kyrie will average 27, 28. 27, 28, you know. And I'm going to give it seven or eight assists. Now, is that going to be better than 25 and 11? The record going to be. That's true. Is that right? She's sipping one way and yeah, I swear I get her wetter. My Louboutin's nose on my bottom stays redder. No, I'm not on ride, but I'm all up on my channel.